All right, so you're looking for the best uh, affordable accessories for Xbox One, the One S and the Xbox One X. In this video, I'm going to break it down for you guys. I'm going to recommend a great bunch of awesome accessories uh, for your Xbox One, stuff that uh, everyone can afford coming up. Welcome back my friends, Robin here from Ships Media and in this video we're going to take a look at the best accessories available for Xbox One. A question before we get things going, how much are you guys willing to pay for a gaming controller? Please let me know in the comments below. Now on this channel I cover a variety of gaming related peripherals such as headsets, headphones, mics, keyboards and so on both for Xbox One and PC, so if you are interested in any of that, consider subscribing, alright? Question again, how much are you guys willing to pay for a gaming controller? Let me know in the comments below. Now with that said, I think it's time to kick things off. Best accessories for Xbox One, first and foremost, if you're a serious gamer, or at least you want the best experience, playing with the included Xbox headset uh, is uh, no good. Now some people might argue that uh, your home theme system might help you out in games where sound is important but in titles such as Overwatch and PUBG I can assure you that the regular speakers won't help you as much as the regular headset. Buying a solid stereo headset is without a doubt the best accessory that you can get for your Xbox One. Now if your controller is of a newer type you can simply just plug any Xbox One supported headset into your controller right off the bat and enjoy a better experience. On the flip side if you're sitting on a system that is a tad bit older you're gonna need something looking like this. With the Xbox One stereo adapter, you're going to be able to connect any Xbox One supported headset directly to your controller. Now the cool thing about the adapter is that uh, you get volume control which lets you set the volume for both in-game sound as well as uh, the voice chat and on top of that a mute button that lights up in yellow when your mic is muted. The stereo headset adapter sits at about $20. I got one myself and I've been using mine for years without any hassle. Best accessory that you can get in terms of value. And that uh, brings me over to the second, well, in my opinion at least, the second most important uh, accessory, which is a solid headset. Now there are hundreds of headsets available for Xbox One and the Xbox One S and the X uh, and I can, uh, can be a little bit confusing. Which one is the best? Well, I guess that is the million dollar question. All headset has their pros and cons. When it comes to the built-in speakers and the characteristics of the sound, taste is uh, very individual. That being said though, one headset that offers great builds, comfort, decent speakers and a great built-in mic is the Turtle Beach Recon 50X or Xbox One. I own these uh, pair myself. They're not that heavy and they're comfortable to wear, the mic is great, music through Spotify sounds great as well for what they cost, but most importantly it gives you that extra edge online that makes online gaming fun and addictive. Now that you got a better understanding where those footsteps are coming from, best of all they cost around $40, probably one of the cheapest ways to take your gaming experience to the next level. Pick up the turtle Beach Recon 50X, it's great value, simply put. Now something that have kept bugging me ever since the very launch of the Xbox 360 has been the wireless blinking low battery controller. The moment and feeling when you're about to game and you're completely out of batteries, right? We have uh, all have that one, right? Well, that is nothing but a memory with the play and charge kit from Microsoft. According to Microsoft, you get up to 12 hours of gaming in a single session. And uh, yeah, if you happen to run out of power, simply plug the included USB cord into the controller and recharge the batteries while you game. Now, uh, 12 hours is uh, a generous number, but uh, you should be able to expect at least 9 
9 to 10 hours that's uh, about what i'm getting now guys if you're sitting on the play and charge kit from microsoft please let me know in the comments below how long you're able to game as well anyway this is a fantastic piece of equipment for any serious warrior out there for a uh, price tag of uh, 20 ish dollars it's not that expensive either and you're going to save a ton of cash in the long run now something that we haven't really touched on yet is the uh, enormous amount of space games nowadays takes up with the xbox one x for example you also have those 4k textures that needs a place to be stored as well now the included one terabyte hard drive might sound much but with single games now taking up as much space as uh, close to or even more than a hundred gig each that uh, one terabyte hard drive will uh, uh, get filled up pretty quickly the uh, xbox one external hard drive from seagate is the answer this fella adds two terabyte extra storage giving you plenty of space for uh, all your titles and the best of all it runs right off the usb port right out of the box and on top of that it matches the xbox one aesthetically as well great uh, great product if you're looking for an easy way to add a little bit of extra space this seagate drive is uh, the definite answer to that last but definitely not least if you want to spice things up a bit but you don't want to blow a giant hole in your wallet the scuff fps adjustable trigger and pro grip combo as well as the control freaks vertex uh, thumbstick might just be what you've been looking for the scuff kit comes with up to five different colors to uh, match your taste and style and gives you that extra grip simply just strap them on and and you're ready to go they're easy to put on and to take off gives you that extra grip and aiming a more expensive controller also offers but uh, for just a few dollars now if you have a little bit more cash to burn the best option then is definitely the xbox one elite controller however don't make the same stupid mistake as i did by uh, borrow it from a friend because uh, once you've tried the elite controller it's impossible to ever go back that's just a heads up and yeah guys that's it now all links to each and every accessory can be found down in the description i also decided to throw in a few extra bonus options that uh, i do really dig as well depending on your budget question guys i want to know your favorite accessory for your xbox i'm dying to know let me know in the comments below and also if you're looking for the best gaming mouse pad as well as the best budget gaming headset or gaming headphones have a peek down in the description i have uh, lined up those videos for you guys as well now there's a ton of videos in the pipe for you guys if you're looking for the best budget gaming mouse uh, headset keyboard headphones and mouse pad and uh, even more consider subscribing also don't forget to tap that bell icon so that you don't miss out on any uploads on my end as i said there's a ton of content in the pipe thank you so much for watching uh, this video my name is robin on chips media until next time guys have an awesome day all right bye